Hello and welcome back to GBA Let's Play, where we play the jewels, jewels, and the junk of Nintendo's most advanced system. Uh, we're back in Pokemon Pinball, Ruby and Sapphire today, and as you can see, I've kind of gone crazy over the weekend. What I ended up doing is I decided that I was going to start a game, and I was going to play that game, and I was going to play that game and use save states to get as much progress as I could, and I kind of did that. So, yeah, we got 127 things in the Pokedex here. A lot of stuff. Like, a whole lot of stuff. Oh, I need to get an Aeron. That's one, oh, that's one thing. I, yeah, I've been avoiding getting an Aeron, because I've been like, I already have this, but no, apparently not. Yeah, I'm trying to get a Vile Plume too. But, like, as you can see, I've got a lot of stuff here. Also, it's interesting that in the... In the... In this Pokemon pinball, Rosalia comes from an egg, despite... And Chimeco both come from eggs. Despite... No, wait, Rosalia's, uh, a catch. Never mind. But, uh... Chimeco comes from an egg, despite the fact that it has a baby Pokemon next gen. Evolve pictures of red orb, and I haven't evolved that yet. I have a lot of stuff to evolve here, but I also, oh yeah, I got these. Uh, apparent. Let's see what happens is when you travel six times, you uh, the sixth travel is to the ruins, which is where you can catch Beldum and the Reggies, which I did. Also, my favorite Pokemon is Metagross, which. You know, I guess if you've seen some of my old Nuzlocke, you kind of knew that, but... Uh, Latios and Latios are 1% chance catches from the catch thing. Uh, I also have caught Kyogre and Rayquaza and Jirachi. So, if you recall from the Ruby board, there's the Groudon fight. Uh, what you do there is you do it twice and you get to catch Kyogre or Groudon, whichever one is your version. And then... The next bonus is Rayquaza, and you have to fight them twice to catch them, and to catch, and in order to fight them again, you have to catch Kyogre, or Rayquaza, or Groudon, based on your version. Jirachi is, uh, part of the, uh, little, uh, the, the spin wheel, the start slot, and what you do is you select, is like, uh, you have 30 seconds to catch him as he moves around. Kind of difficult, but... So, rather than going ham and still using save states, what I've decided to do is just play this game to its completion. So, I'm catching a tentacle here. Also, I've... I'm at nine uh, extra... I'm at nine balls, so... I've actually... I actually tried to get another one through the start slot, and it wouldn't. I've already caught a tentacle on this board. I've already got a tentacle pool. It's just a matter of... There we go. I can also show you the various bonus fights on this board. Because I don't think you've, uh, you, the viewers, have seen those yet. I'm also at 99 multiplier because of course I am at this point. At this point, the Mart has nothing for me. All it has for me is Ball Saber, and I don't really care about those because I'm trying to run out the timer with this, really. I guess I'll get 30 coins, just throw myself up to 100 again. I can't even buy them. Oh yeah, I've also caught so many Pokemon that this, that the Evolution Select, doesn't contain all the Pokemon that I have anymore. So... Oh, I already don't have a tentacle, but... Alright. Oh, dang it, it's a sunstone again. I'm trying to get a, a vile plume here. Uh, I failed it last time, but... Uh, I kind of failed on purpose, because I didn't want to get the fucking... Uh, I lost one of the wild. Oh, that one's gonna be 
a bitch to get. Uh, that one, yeah, the one in the middle of the, of the uh, shroomish over there is always a bitch to get. Because you gotta, like, angle it perfectly. Even with tilting, you can't really get in there very easily. So, kinda gotta do this. Hope that you can get in there. Which is not easy. Though, if I was trying to get a different Evo, like, if I wasn't in Evo mode right now... Almost. Almost had that one there. But, oh well, it's, it's a Sunstone, which means I'm gonna get another Colossal now. I want that. And there we go. Now that's active, at least. Yeah, no, I'm definitely not making this. I'm good. I've gotten good at this game, but not that good. I usually have to save state and just, like, hope it doesn't end up in there. There we go. Yeah, no, like I said, I wasn't getting it. But it's okay, because it's not a leaf stone, it's a fucking sunstone. Yep. I also need to travel because the... I think I've caught everything that I can catch here. So it's not much point in being here anymore, but the next travel is the ruins again, and I don't want that. I'm gonna have to travel and travel again. That's a nice little trick that I learned. Celios feel uh, bonus stage, which is mostly just a time waster, <laughs> for being honest. Dang it! Almost. I was honestly trying to go for the travel there, but hey, I'll take it. Hey, maybe I'll get to see the bonus. Or I'll just get a big bonus. Five mil, sure. There we go. Let's see what we hatch. A Zubat. I already have a Crobat. Doesn't really matter to me if I make this or not. Ball save. At least we don't lose the ball yet. Although now the ball save is out, so we might. Gotta be better about it. Like I say, the Pika saver is, is, has saved my butt several times. Yeah, Zubat was caught. We don't really need that anymore, but sure, why not? And let's show you. The bonus. As opposed to the Kecleon one, which is kind of annoying, this one's actually really sweet. Also, I figured out what the uh, different types of Pokeballs are for. In bonus stages like this, they give you a bonus multiplier, basically, that's it up to a times four for a Master Ball. Rather than, you know, making your catches easier or stuff like that. Yeah. Duskull will vanish after a time, but it's all faster to just hit them. Not much to talk about here while the Duskull are just kind of milling around. Looking for the dust clocks. Yeah, whatever. 
Like I said, it doesn't really... Ah, uh, here we go. We're almost on. There we go! There we go. There we go. Got a hit. He takes like four hits to go down. And then he can do that, which is kind of annoying, but... There we go. Bitch. Oh yeah, I'm also at like 2.5 billion points on this thing, which is a bit excessive, I agree. But that's not what we're here for. We're here to watch me play the soft fireboard. And kind of fail to lose, I guess, is the technical term. Also, it's impossible to refuse the uh, Celia bonus one. The other ones you can refuse just as much as you want, but the Celia bonus one you can't. Ah, I can go to the Mart again. They sold out of extra ball, that's really the only thing I care about at this point. So I just, I just get like an upgrade or something. Oh hey, sweet, we can finally travel. And you can see what the ruins look like. Which, you know, I don't really matter. There we go. Got it. Yep. Travel to the ruins. I know this because I save stated and then had reset after I traveled, so... All I know is that when I do eventually lose a ball, it's going to give me so many points. Okay, nothing I care about here, so I'm not gonna bother pressing the physics again. Sure, a ball saver, why not? At this point, we just want to travel again, because there's nothing here for me. I've already caught anything here. Honestly, if I, do, if I do actually get something, I'm probably just going to toss it back. There we go. But, like I said, we don't want the catch here. I just got something. Probably an email. There we go. Evo mode. Now we can try for the, 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 the vile thing again. This trap I've already got the Bravo and Flag on. Gulp I've already got Squall on. I don't have Magnemite yet. Got two Clam Pearl. So... Alright, tell you what. I'm gonna safe state here and see if I can actually get a Leaf Stone. Nope. Sometimes that helps me, sometimes I'm still just not good at this. Come on, I'm getting the fucking whalmer.
Get the fucking Whalmer, Shinji. Evangelion. There we go. Got the fucking Whalmer, Shinji. Now we get to get a magnet out of get to add a magnet on. start here, actually. Dang it! I already have all of the catches from... Alright, another Beldum, I guess. Why not? Okay, apparently it's when you release the buttons. That was almost it. Gaston music. Him internet meme actually recently. Kind of funny. Kind of perverse. Dark in that sort of way. There we go. Yeah, another Beldum that I don't need. Though you do get to see now the Kyogre bonus stage. Which will probably be the end of our little excursion here. Because, <sighs> yeah, I've done, I've actually not lost a life this whole time, which I'm, I'm as surprised as you are, honestly. But. is difficult to hit. You gotta aim for it when he comes up. Ah, I got him. Ow! There we go. There we go. Walking here. Everybody does that terrible Christopher Walken. Ow, oh, come on! Alright. Come on. This is why I usually save state for because it's a lot easier. Ooh, that was good. Sometimes you get really good hits like that. The whirlpool dragon down. Oh, there we go. Good. And we missed him because I was I let the ball drop. If I actually had a, great, a higher level ball, oh, that was gonna hit him, and you know it. Probably close to dead at this point. Oh wow, three hits. Dang it. Ah, almost had it. I've learned that this actually does help get it out of there faster. Dang it. down. Come on. No, I am not going to lose this. No! 
Come on, I am so close here. Oh, perfect! And I caught him, which means I think I'm going to go be facing Rayquaza next. And potentially be able to catch him, too. So, yeah, wow, like I said, this was going to end it out for us. So let's save here. Alright, great. Not only did you get to see what the Sapphire board looks like, but you also got to see two of its bonus stages. All I gotta do next time is get to the next bonus stage to be able to see Rayquaza. So, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time on GBA Let's Play. Goodbye.